Hello 2006 fans of the original Disney Pixar Cars 1 movie. Today, I am going to review Cruise and Light McQueen, another car from the original movie. So let's just start. As you know, he has been released in 2007, many, many years ago, and is still released to this day. And he's been released every year except for the year of Cars one, um, Cars 2 and Cars 3, but he has been released many times. And he's still released to this day in the two-pack with Doc Hudson and last year in the two-pack with Sally. So, at, and in the movie, we know that Light McQueen is making Raiders Springs even better, and he went to Louis de Chassadel tires to get the white wall tires, and then he went into Fillmore to ha try the organic fuel that he did, had. Then Sar he went to Sar to the test his night vision goggles. Then Lucy and how he got the three bumper stickers that reads Kingpin, Barstow, San Bernardino. And he also lastly went into Ramon's house of body art. And Ramon gave him this new fancy paint job where he is completely metallic red with this old school oval part with the lightning bolt without the spoiler and he is very slick and he is shiny and he appears out of Ramon Sahabadiar and then this song played and the radius mirror was light up in neon and it was lighting up again and then they went, and then everyone went for a cruise along with lightning. And then he was with Lucy, and then Vader told him, and then they, he went to Sally. And that's all for the appearance of Cruise and Lightning McQueen from Cars 1. So, anyways, let's get on to the review of this amazing diecast. One of my favorite paint jobs of Lightning McQueen. From Cars 1. So as you, see, you can see. He has this really. Calm. Very nice expression. And. He has a really nice. Metallic paint. And it is shiny. He also has. The bolts on the hood. He also has. A sticker headlight still. And a sticker tail lights. He has his window bars that are still red. He also has the gas cap and the exhaust pipes. But he has white wall tires with red and gray silver hubcaps. He has this really amazing white part right here where we see the classic lightning bolt. And that is the same part that is on Raider Springs and McQueen, but a little bit different. And stay tuned, guys, because I will review Raider Springs and McQueen after this video. Anyways, as you can see, this is the Made in Thailand version. I'm reviewing this one because it has the add bumper stickers in the back. The one from China didn't have that. And I'm assuming if Vietnam will do it, it won't have the bumper stickers. Because Vietnam's are the China wannabes. Also, Cruise McQueen actually had a color changer in 2021, last year. And he changed from red to black. And it looks very cool. I like the color changer. It looks very amazing. Anyways, on to Cruise and McQueen. Um, the uh, back right here, the, the bumper stickers read Kingpin Barstow San Bernardino. No, 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 no. Also, a fact you may notice, despite this paint job of McQueen not appearing in Cars 2, he made an appearance in Cars 2, the video game, and no, he wasn't a DLC character. Now, for all the Cars 2 the video game fans, if you have that game and if you're having trouble unlocking Ra Cruise and Light McQueen, aka Radiator Lightning, that's how they call him in the game, you basically had to get the Runaway Pancake Badge or Crest. 
and you basically have to go to a runaway tour and get hit by the plane three times, and then when you get the runaway pancake um, achievement, and after that, you unlock Cruisin' Lightning McQueen. And in the game, he also had the bumper stickers, and this is the only game where Cruise and Light McQueen was able to appear. He somehow never made it into Cars 2 debut, or, I mean, Cars the debut game, or Mayor National Race Rama for some reason. I wonder why, but Danico McQueen did, although Danico McQueen wasn't in Mayor National. Although, it kind of was for Race Rama because of the monster truck paint job. But anyways, here's Cruz and McQueen with Sally, and they both were released in the movie Moments 2 Back Together, and that happened in 2007, 2008, 2009, 2010, many of that, and they were released in the 2 Pack Together and a lot, and they were recently in the 2 Pack Together in 2021. And I gotta say, that is a pretty cool 2 Pack. And yeah, that is pretty much it for the review of Cruise and Lightning McQueen. And by the way, here's the setup right here. So anyways, guys, so that is it for today's video. Make sure to subscribe to my channel because I'll be making more Disney Pixar Cars videos for my channel. And more diecast reviews. And stay tuned for Cars 2 very soon. I will do Cars 2 and Cars 3 and Cars 2 reviews. But right now I'm doing Cars 1. So anyways guys, that is pretty much it. And bye now.